Hello everyone, my name is I Like Being Smart. This is a video response to K-Pop's subscriber challenge of explosives only. And I don't I don't do fantastic on uh, this game. My KD in this game and in Modern Warfare 2 is only about between 0.25 and 0.3. I know that's kind of sad, but I don't really play it for KD. I play it for fun. In addition to the fact that I've only been playing it for maybe a few months total. So I never even played Modern Warfare 2 before a few months ago. So I played a whole bunch of different matches. I didn't want to do live commentary because I knew it was going to be hard enough as it was. Uh, I had the XM25. There I realized I blew up my own C4, which was just fantastic. Um, I get a lot of lag during gameplay. It doesn't really show up too much in the replays, or in the theater mode, but I get a lot of lag, so that kind of doesn't help. And I'm using the XM25 and the M4A1 grenade launcher because that is the primary assault rifle I like to use. Uh, recently I just got the AK-47, which I'm leveling up, and I'm also leveling up the SCAR at the moment. So I actually prefer the MP5. That's my favorite gun in this game. So I'm trying to figure out where people are. And like I said, my strategy is I'm a rusher, but I'm a really, really bad rusher. <laughs> and uh, this these Predator missiles, I'm like, I would guess at least five or six of my deaths in this game are because of those damn Predator missiles. And it's just frustrating. The reason I'm using uh, UAV and counter UAV for support uh, kill streaks. First of all, because support kill streaks is pretty much all I can do. I can't really use assault and get really high stuff. That's what care packages are for. <laughs> and I bastard up there. I knew he was up there too. It was very frustrating. Like I said, I'm a rusher. I'm not a very good rusher. And I have Dead Man's Hand. Because if you... I was thinking too, if it's an explosive only challenge, might as well use a death streak that has explosives. And though I usually use martyrdom because that's awfully fun and pisses people off, I figured I'd try a little uh, Dead Man's Hand, which helps on... Which helps a lot on domination because then people, like, especially if you try to cap a point and then all of a sudden it's like, you know, oh, like that. And then people start walking toward you and then you kill them and it's a lot of fun. So, <laughs> and the reason why I'm using UAV counter UAV by themselves is because I was trying to get um, the. I had just unlocked the Intimidation Challenges, so I was trying to get three UAVs in a match, three counter UAVs in a match, and this is the quickest way I could think of to get that. So, and I got a whole bunch of cool, uh, I got a whole bunch of really cool, what, I was like, what the, f <laughs> so I think I'm pimping, pimping, jeez, I think I have Sleight of Hand, Hardline, Dead Silence, I want to say. So Sleight of Hand Pro, Hard Lane Pro, Dead Silence Pro. So, and C4 as you can see, and uh, I think those are stun grenades if I remember right. So this isn't too, I mean, outside of like the explosives, it's not too far outside of what I normally play in regards to having the uh, support kill streaks and whatnot. So I think I get a kill here. Oh yeah. No, I don't. Do I? That said, I got a kill. Oh, uh, yeah. Must have gotten a kill in last stand or final stand or something. Um, do they have last stand in this game? I can't. I don't think they do. They have final stand, so. so no? Well, that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, I killed a dude, so. <laughs> I think I go 8 and 29 in this match, but I get quite a few caps and I get over a thousand total points. And for me, that's... For some people, that's pretty substandard. For me, that's pretty good. A fairly good match is somewhere... Somewhere between 1,000 and 1,500. 
an average game is between 500 and 1,000. And then anything over 1,500 is pretty is pretty BA. So about halfway through the match, I'm pretty confident, and I don't know if I killed that guy or not. I was a little worried about that. Um, <laughs> I was pretty confident that I was going to get my three UAVs, three counter UAVs, with how much I was capping. Because that's more what I worry about with domination anyway. So, and pretty soon... Yeah, I got that one too. That was pretty sweet. I tried to knife him and then I realized, oh crap, this is an explosive only challenge. It was kind of panic knife, so... I didn't kill him though, which I guess is the kind of important part. Usually I'd have a stinger and I'd shoot that down, but again, explosives only. Kind of makes for an interesting little challenge, which is... I liked doing it. I did like... I think I did maybe three or four matches. In the match before this, I think I got three and twenty-five or something like that. And somebody was like, how could you get three and twenty-five at this game? And I'm like, because I'm doing a challenge. <laughs> I'm doing a challenge. It's not easy when you're not used to this kind of setup. And then that's normally when I would just shoot the hell out of him. So... I have to go to work in a little bit. I figured I did this before. I have to go to work. So I did about three or four matches like this. And... Then eventually I just switched back to going and shooting people. So. <laughs> Somebody who's coming through. <laughs> I'm not sure if I got it though, is the thing. I know I got the counter UAV title, but I don't know if I got the UAV one. I might have to try it on assault. So kind of my next challenge is, it's kind of hard for me to get uh, stealth bombers, uh, 14, and I did get it, okay. I got the counter, I don't think I got the UAV though. So it's kind of hard for me to get stealth bombers right now, even with hardline, it's 13 points, which if I'm usually getting... You know, I don't know, five, six kills a game. It's kind of hard to get. Though I do have hard line on, so that includes assists, which usually gets me two more points. So my next goal on this game, I see this guy here, and I'm like, God damn it, I'm going to get him. So my next goal is to start working towards seeing if I can get some... Not on assault kill streaks because I know... That's not possible. And even my highest kill streak without major. Uh, I think my highest kill streak in My Warfare 2 is 12. So, and that was. I needed a pave low for half of those kills out of, off of a care package. So, like in here, it's only four, but that's because the lag is just wretched. The lag is just so bad in this game for me. I don't know if it's because of my computer or my internet. Regardless, it sucks, but I like playing it anyway. And so my next goal is to try to get, you know, some of the... I'll probably use hardline, so 17 point kill streaks on support, you know, EMP, Juggernaut, uh, what's the third one? Uh, escort airdrop. So that's my next goal. <laughs> that's pretty sweet. That was an awesome kill. <laughs> So I, like I said, I use this match because I end up getting four counter UAVs in one match. So for me, that's pretty good. That means I'm getting them. Not getting a lot of kills necessarily, but getting a lot of caps, getting a lot of assists. Helping the team out, you know? And then they just get like 10 gajillion air support. It's like, oh, I'm fucked. <laughs> so there you go. There's my... Uh, we stall for a little while longer. But... Doesn't look like I'm gonna die for the rest of the match. So, I think I ended up 8 and 20 something. There. <laughs> because they were bitching at me. I said, that better?
<laughs> one guy's taking me seriously, the other guy is like, no. <laughs> I don't know if it pops up, but yeah. <laughs> so I go 8 and 29, 2 assists, meaning I got 9 nine points from kills and assists, and then the other 7 were from caps. So, defense and whatnot. So that was my uh, little uh, subscriber response to K-pop. Just so try something different. You know, I'm not fantastic at the game. I knew I wasn't going to break even. But of the couple matches I did it with, this is the best result I had. So I hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to check out other things on my channel if you if you like this and like my commentary. Uh, some of the main games I've done are uh, Super Mario 64, Super Mario RPG, uh, both the Super Mario Worlds. Um, I stick primarily to N64 and super nes games though i have done portal and am currently doing a lp of portal 2 single player so that's my stuff hope you enjoyed it my name is i like being smart peace out